Hey everybody, it's Miss Amy with here with another science experiment for you. Today's science experiment is called the static flyer. So we're going to be talking about static electricity today. Now all objects have charges and typically uh, the objects are balanced between positive and negative charges. So static electricity is what occurs when there's an imbalance between the positive and negative charges in an object. So for this experiment, what you're gonna need is a balloon, and you're gonna have to blow that up. You're gonna need um, something made of cotton fabric that you can use uh, to rub on these objects that we have here. So I'm using an old t-shirt. You could use a towel or a cotton rag. Um, you're also gonna need a piece of plastic, and we're gonna try and make this plastic float above the balloon. So we've got three different types here that we're gonna try. So this is from a newspaper bag. This is from a Ziploc bag, so it's a little bit thicker plastic. And this is from a produce bag from the grocery store. So it's thin, but it's also larger than the other two. And so any type of plastic, what you wanna do, whether it's whatever type of bag you use, you're gonna to wanna to cut it so that you end up with a ring like this. So a strip of plastic all contained in the ring. So then all you need to do is you're gonna take your cotton shirt or towel or rag. I'm actually gonna do the plastic first. And you're gonna rub it. Let's try this one. You're gonna flatten it down and you're gonna rub the cotton against the plastic for about 30 to 45 seconds to give it a nice, good charge here. So what this is doing is transferring a negative charge to the plastic. So sometimes when you rub certain materials against other types, it can transfer that charge. So that's what we're doing is making sure we have a negative charge. And so then I'm gonna do the same thing to the balloon. And again, try and estimate about 30 to 45 seconds. And kind of go all over. So we're transferring a negative charge to the balloon. Now, we know that like charges, like if you think about with magnets, like charges are going to repel each other, right? And opposite charges attract. So by transferring a negative charge, to both our balloon surface and our plastic surface, the idea is that we would hopefully get these charges to repel and cause the plastic <laughs> to float. See, now the plastic wants to stick to me because we have a positive charge, but see, the plastic just wants to, <laughs> to attach to me. Ah. That's the hardest part about this experiment is, well, and maybe I didn't rub for long enough on the balloon in order to get it to be a good negative charge. Let me try this plastic. And you can experiment with different types of plastic you have at home and concentrate on one spot on this one. to float and now the wall obviously has a positive charge so the negative charge on the plastic wants to stick to it but there you go you can make a piece of plastic levitate all you need is a balloon and a cotton shirt pretty cool all right so that's our static flyer 
good luck with your own experiment. Thanks for watching.